The PTL's challenge, the PTL sandwich challenge is on right now. Last week was the launch. We answered the call. All six members of Team PTL created a waffle sandwich. So we have all the sandwich here. All of these were created at Waffles and Caffeinated this morning. They are fresh and ready to eat along with these onion rings that I've already sampled. <laughs> Delicious. This is so tempting right now. And we have some fun combinations here and we're starting with mine first. Should we explain how this works for people? Yeah, we should explain how it works. Okay. So we've all created, we all went through the menu and we all picked different sandwiches. So all of Team PTL has that. Yes. And then. So we created our own sandwich. You are going to be able to try these at Waffles and Caffeinated next week, a couple days, yes, limited specific days. specific days, we'll let you know. We're going to let you know which days you can try them and then you can vote and whatever sandwich wins is on I the know. menu. You know, all right. whichever one you want to pick. Okay, so uh, we are going to start so with So anyhow, yeah, the Highfield Tower is coming up first. And so you go ahead and take a bite okay. of it. I will explain what's in it. So it's on standard sourdough waffle. It has a bacon crumble and dried cranberries with a fried egg over, over medium. Egg. It has goat cheese in it. Also mm. avocado slices, baby spinach, and hollandaise sauce on top. Wow, David. What do you think? I that have to try it. Really, I, I have really not tried good. it myself yet, Watch, so I don't the know. Egg, the egg is a fried the egg. egg so okay. Gonna, what do you think? That is delicious. I love oh, the I little like that. sweetness that you get mm -hmm. and the saltiness. That's delicious. All that right, David, is a good one, if I do say so myself. I like that. Good job, David. All right. Next up is mine, the mm -hmm. Heather's Hawaiian Punch. So this is a waffle with bacon crumbles oh and jalapenos gosh. in the batter. Okay. Oh, that's so cool. So you're going to get a little spice there. There is also ham, bacon, pepper jack cheese, pineapple, and spicy mayo. You know what? I want a second bite of yours, so that's a very good song. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. It's good? Is it too mm -hmm. spicy? I haven't tried it yet. This mm -hmm. is the first time we're sampling any of these. Mm -hmm. Is it good? Too hot? It is really good. It is not too spicy. I like that one, too. I mean, they're both I very different. Um, so next up is Ron's, uh, and Ron's is a... a PBC, mm. peanut butter cups. So it's a waffle. It is vegan with chocolate and peanut butter chips, chocolate sauce, peanut butter, strawberry jam or jelly, and fresh strawberry. Uh, kind of minimal, but you know what? With these ingredients, it doesn't need to be over the top the because they just sing together. It's a great combination. All right, so oh, I have to try delicious. this now. Oh my gosh. Ron, yep. amazing. That one's good too. Very sweet. But so good. Mm. You're gonna love that one. Okay. <clears throat> oh, that's like dessert. It's a dessert oh, yeah. sandwich. Mm -hmm. All right. But like elevated on a whole other level. Let's get to Mikey's. Ooh. I've already tried the onion rings. They're delicious. Um, this is a traditional waffle. There's a burger, uh, and I think this is a traditional sourdough. Is how they describe okay. it. Uh, there's a burger on there. There's bacon, American cheese, spicy mayo, and she said that she wanted onion rings on the side. There's a hamburger in here. You said a burger. Yeah, that's like a hamburger. I just looked. <laughs> I just looked down and I was like, "There's a hamburger in this, Heather." I don't. I did I you need just... me to be more formal? <laughs> it's a hamburger. <laughs> I just. I was so taken with what it looked like. I, the words you were saying didn't stick in my was head. It the I, onion I, rings that did I'm gonna sample. You sample. Mm -hmm. um, and I think this is great. And remember when I said mm. I know which one is gonna win? Mm -hmm. That's the one that I thought. Because it's so traditional and it looks so good, and I think people are going to lean towards that comfort food. I like Is the burger delicious? idea a lot. Yeah, I really do. All, All right. right, I'm going to try this, but do you want to talk about Selena's, or do you need a moment? I just need a moment to swallow here. Okay, so let's talk Got about it. Selena's up here. She has Selena's spicy Italian Sammy. Mm -hmm. Again, the waffle is standard sourdough. There's pepperoni, salami. Um, provolone cheese, and then she added a whole bunch of veggies too. Yeah, in fact, you sample Selena's right now, and okay. I will tell you about some of the veggies. So she has quite a list. So black olives, green pepper, roasted tomato, baby leaf spinach, yeah. and jalapeno. And you know what? Oh, you amazing. taste the jalapeno, and also she also chose the spicy mayo. And the spicy mayo is just the right level of spice. Amazing. It leaves a little tingle in your mouth at the end. Really, really good. That's delicious. All right, and okay. let's get to Daisy's up next. Now, this is a double decker. Oh, look as at the you overachiever see. she is. Okay, we have a double decker, regular waffle with jalapeno in the batter. So mm -hmm. she followed suit. You can see it right yeah. in there. In I think the waffles. It has just that kick that you need. Mm -hmm. um, there's spicy sausage and scrambled egg, avocado, 
uh, and bacon. Oh, and then in the too. second layer, there's spicy sour cream, pico de gallo, pepper jack cheese. Oh, I don't know why. Okay. <laughs> You're digging it. It's a big sandwich. It's a big sandwich. Well, do you get the kick? I get the kick. And you know what? There's more of a veggie action thing to it than I anticipated. Yeah. It's really good. Because well, you have that avocado, which is like a nice mm -hmm. thick layer in there, and then the I pico de gallo. Avocado. So good. This is going to so be really good. hard to decide. It's going to be really tough. But beginning next week, you get your chance to vote. So all four waffles and caffeinated locations will be making our creations on Monday, December 13th, December 15th, and then Friday, December 17th. So it's those three specific dates. Yes. You could go in, order one or all six, and then use a special uh, QR code in the restaurant to cast your vote. We also want to note this too, waffles and caffeinated. We've been holding out, uh -huh. and we can now officially say it. Wait, 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 wait. They will now be selling our PTL mugs. Boom. So not only can you go in and order one of these delicious sandwiches and try it and cast your vote, you can also get a mug. And one of our Friday free for all it. questions last week was about that specifically. Where can you get the mugs now? Answer. So now you can Christmas shop while also testing some of our sandwiches next Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Yeah. So again, we want you to vote. We want to find out which one you think is the best one. We're very excited about it. And I think they're all potential winners. Really so, good. Yeah.